Hi there, Deputy Chief Officer Greg Patterson from CFA Training, um, and welcome to a, another edition of Taking It to the Streets. With me is Operations Manager Gary Weir. Gary is the Manager of Wildfire Planning and also our Forest Industry Brigades. I'm absolutely wrapped to be able to talk to you today about an initiative that uh, we've had a, a massive um, result, great result of, and that is the Learning Hub, the CFA's new Learning Hub is now live. It is a culmination of a, a huge amount of work by a really dedicated team, and it is a great result for the organisation. It's a great result for our people. So by all means, get online through Brigades Online and go and have a look at the new Learning Hub. Apart from being able to access your records, your training records, and also access to the training catalogue and calendar, um, it will also provide us with some opportunities in the latter half of 2017 to move into some digital learning. Digital learning is going to offer us a much more flexible way of delivering training and better access to, to uh, training for our volunteers and for our people, uh, which is what you wanted and which is part of our learning action plan. Um, it's not going to replace face-to-face -face learning, but it's certainly going to open up another option for people to do training at their leisure. A great example of the, uh, the digital learning is the uh, Hazardous Trees um, online training that will be available shortly. So I'm going to hand it over to Gary. But Gary, can you just tell us about the Hazardous Trees module and what people can expect to learn from that module? Uh, the Learning Hub's going to provide us a great opportunity to be able to get this new training out associated with making our members more aware of hazardous trees quickly and efficiently before the, even the next fire season potentially, which is probably a big plus to where we've been in the past. Um, what people will do is they'll get on the Learning Hub and they'll see the module associated with hazardous tree awareness and they'll be able to go through it and it will be an interactive type process where they come across certain circumstances um, associated with dangerous limbs, trees in different positions um, and they'll be able to then identify what the situation is, they'll be able to enter that information and by a self-assessment type process go through the whole process so by the end of it they should have a complete understanding of hazardous trees. So it sounds like a great initiative Gary and it, uh, obviously going to be available to everyone on the uh, Learning Hub in a couple of weeks' time. So uh, the great thing about that is we'll actually be able to see exactly how many people have actually accessed uh, this training um, and it will go into the training records. Um, so it give, gives us a really good view of this safety initiative and how many people it's actually reached out to in Surf 8. Um, you will see a whole bunch more online training occurring in the, in the second half of 2017. So watch this space. We're really excited. The Learning Hub has launched. Um, so, so far, we've had in excess of 5,000 individuals log in uh, once to the Learning Hub, so people are aware it's out there. Get online, go and have a bit of a look. Give us your feedback. As I've always said, we really want to work with the front line. We're, we're interested in your feedback and your thoughts. So give us your feedback and uh, stay tuned for the next, uh, next session of Taking It to the Streets. And stay safe.